The following figure shows parts of a simple DC motor. On figure, write in each of the boxes the name of the part of the motor to which the arrow is pointing. We have two boxes pointing to some parts of the motor. It's important to know how to draw a motor and how to label its parts. The upper box points to what is named as carbon brushes and the lower box points to the commutators. This is a two-mark question. Each box is for one mark. For the upper box you can say brush or contact or sliding connectors. They all give the same meaning, but carbon brush is the more accurate answer. This gives you one mark. For the lower box, you can say split ring or commutator, but do not say slip rings because slip rings are not for the motor, slip rings are for the AC generator. So you cannot say slip rings. This is the first question. The second question B. Draw arrows to show the direction of electric current flow in the coil between the poles. Doesn't look like an electric motor question. Electric current simply flows from positive to negative. So this is how we will draw our arrows. The mark scheme awards one mark for arrows correctly shown from positive to negative.